Yeah, that's right, Lauren and Steve, and they have had this area blocked off uh, for the last several hours. Very much an active scene right here. I'm going to step out of the way and kind of show you where we are talking about. You see the tape uh, up right here. This is where that foot chase came to an end, just about half a mile from the CVS on Ramsey Street where this all happened. Now, police say this all started just up the street at that CVS. A man came in, pulled out a gun to rob the store. They complied and they gave him the money, but unbeknownst to that suspect, they also added a GPS tracker to that money as he took off. And because of that, about 10 minutes later, police were able to catch up with him, ending up right where we are now. It's uh, um, partially a residential neighborhood. There's a VFW hall, a few businesses. I spoke with a neighbor who was just a few hundred feet away when this happened. And then next thing you know, you heard a couple of gunshots, one or two, I don't remember. And a bunch of police flew in. It's like, wow, <laughs> I'm back in Chicago. <laughs> it, it was just wild. Yeah, so obviously that neighbor uh, pretty shaken up, but this investigation still ongoing right now. Uh, we do know that no officers uh, were injured in all of this. We do know that that suspect again was taken to the hospital, but we're still uh, waiting to learn what led up to those uh, shots being fired, how many shots were fired. We are told from police uh, that a weapon was recovered here at the scene, but uh, beyond that, they still have the forensic uh, crews out here trying to piece together more of that. That is all part of the investigation. Again, this area right here in Fayetteville still blocked off as they continue to investigate. We're live in Fayetteville. Tom George, ABC 11 Eyewitness News.